So five years ago, when I became Microsoft's channel chief, I realized that I was in a position to make a bigger difference. I had an ecosystem of 300,000 plus organizations around the world and high tech that were watching me. And, mm -hmm. um, you know, Satya said when he became the CEO that there are times when you serve the company and there are times when the company can serve you. And I saw this as an opportunity for me to take a stand within the industry and to build a platform to drive for gender equity in high tech. And so that's really been my journey. And, and because there are so few of us, I, I also recognize I'm, I'm a natural draw for others who seek advocacy and sponsorship. And so it gave me access to so many stories like the ones you hear from Julia and Paul um, and points of view and lived experiences. So I could carry those into the areas where I could contribute and influence change and allowed me to see where this allyship is needed. And so I sponsored building two organizations dedicated to this cause of gender equity, um, the Women in Technology Network and the Women in Cloud. And through these organizations, we've reached 20,000 women around the world mm -hmm. and really mobilized them and provided access and encouragement for them to build new companies in technology. And Yet, while 20,000 seems like a big number, it's actually just a drop in the bucket to what we really need, which is closer to, we need 8 million women in the industry to have parity and 4 million more.